Hi, this is Jay Hart, and uh, I, I did a collage book project in this 10 pocket display book. And what it is is page protectors that are bound together. And there's 10 pockets in this thing. And so front and back, that's 20 pages plus the front cover. And here's my book. Is the spine that is a pocket and so I made this uh, stamp collage actually that's just printed paper so here's the book and I hope the glare isn't too bad so um, and do I need to go up a bit that didn't really help Okay, so um, the idea was that I wanted to use my brown paper bags because you got to save those because it's a valuable craft material. And uh, these are images that were too big for uh, my previous collage project. So I used this uh, sticker set, and here was the title of it, Forever. And um, I used up almost all of the letters writing out postage stamp collages and here's my name Jay Hart and uh, I didn't have any numbers so I used uh, Roman numerals these are upside down W's that look like M's and X's and an I so that's 2021 uh, and each page has some postage stamps so I put something in her hair and on her shoulder So here's the first one, and these are um, maybe not current stamps. Whenever I find interesting stamps, I buy them, and these are printed paper, but that made a, a pretty collage. Uh, this is a paperback cover that I used the book for something else. And uh, just decorated with some stamps and um, this uh, floral. And uh, this one is, uh, the background is some tissue paper. And the colors are this uh, violet and greens. So I added some uh, alternating those colors of stamps. And these are blue and golds. This is some product packaging that I ripped in half and used the, the ripped edges for decoration. <clears throat> and this is something I fussy cut from a magazine. And look closely, there's my address. Using this picture as my uh, uh, color inspiration. And here, these are some more product packaging labels. Just some leftover bits here and there. And I do like to use uh, uh, fortunes, um, astrologies, uh, you know what I mean, uh, to indicate um, the year or the month or the day that I make these things. Uh, these are postage stamps. They were, it was a set of uh, four, and you could uh, take them apart and use them as individual stamps. And these, uh, I did them cascading to uh, cover up the colors that I didn't want to include in this uh, composition. Valentine's Day. These are current stamps. You can get them now. A music sheet and uh, some uh, lovers and here's another remarkable love story they were married uh, forever and this is a paper napkin from uh, Tuesday morning and this was uh, a book cover that um, was in a magazine, so I cut that out and uh, decorated. Oh, here's some of that leftover tissue from that previous page. 
just some odds and ends and bits. And this, um, I cut this guy out, uh, cut away the, the boring background, and uh, filled it in with uh, postage stamps that uh, were in the, that color range. A lot of magazine and newspaper bits and bobs to make a pretty portrait. And uh, this is a magazine advertisement that uh, something uh, based in Paris. And uh, this is a vase. And that might be uh, Napoleon and uh, uh, his wife. What was her name? <laughs> but I'm not sure. And these are uh, greens and uh, maybe a bits of uh, yellow and orange. And these are current stamps. That's from a current stamp set. And a label from a drink. Uh, these are uh, stamps that I've had for quite a while. Uh, you know, these are forever stamps, but uh, you can't uh, get them if they're uh, gone. I uh, just bordered it with some uh, quilting print. And this was actually a collage that I made quite a while ago and uh, wanted to use it. So here's another one where I cut away the boring background and put it onto another magazine page. Blue Moon Beer, and these are product packagings, labels that um, I used for that. And these are supposed to look like clouds. This is uh, from a CD label. And some more product packaging that I ripped and uh, used, the, used it apart. Some more clouds up there. Just some interesting uh, buildings that I cut away the sky. Did I skip any? Oh, and the last page. This is from a Japanese children's uh, magazine. Um, and it looks to me like uh, lovers. I don't know. That sort of looks like a heart. And I just filled it in with some uh, pink stamps. So that was my very fun project to do.